White Ladder was a chord sequence I wrote probably almost 10 years before I finally used it on the record. I wrote it while I was a student in Liverpool playing with a guitar and I just discovered these chords. So you were up on the ninth fret, letting the A string, B string and E string ring, but holding down with your pinky and your third finger the D string and the G string on the ninth fret as long as as well as the E string at the top. So and the next chord is, is, a, is a B but with the E string and the B string ringing at the bottom and then you move the whole sequence down exactly the same chords but two frets down. It fret. So it cycles around this. again cycle down becomes a minor when you move it onto the fifth fret and then the same at G again with the E and the B ringing underneath and then slide that down to an F sharp back up to a G and then straight chord those two down there held at the top so the uh, G and the B string on the second fret and then it's the D and the G string still holding that um, on the third fret with the pinky so holding again with the thumb on the third fret and then you've got one of those underneath so it's like a C shape uh, third and second fret A and D string and then you're holding the B string uh, on the third fret and you slide that up to it becomes a sort of D to the night of the valentine burning to a dog barking around here. Really looking forward to playing this one because it's a song that doesn't get played enough. So when we did it originally on White Ladder it wasn't as rewarding to do. We didn't quite know how to do about it because the drum samples were such that we didn't feel we could do the song any justice sonically without them, but it meant that Clune wasn't really doing much, so that just meant he was sort of asking around, playing a bit of ride cymbal and adding a few extra kick drums and stuff. 
on this tour because we've got more technology at our fingertips he's going to be triggering the samples and actually playing the beat so uh, I think that's going to make it, the whole thing a lot more lively to play so I'm really looking forward to that one big time.